baby steps towards turning Nigeria's teetotalers into avid coffee drinkers. This coffee shop located in the Nigerian capital, Abuja, is an initial step into this market by Classic Rock Coffee, a franchise from India. It opened shop in December last year, and its owners are already thinking big, dotting Nigeria's major cities with coffee shops. This is the first branch in whole West Africa. So we are the master franchisee of Nigeria. So we have big plans to open another branches also in Abuja. Next, we are coming up in Lagos Airport. We are opening a brand, our branch there also. So within two years, we have a plan to open three to four branches more. But how do you get a predominantly tea drinking nation to drink coffee? It's just branding and keep your coffee taste well. That's what people need. If your coffee is nice and you need to do little marketing, people should know your brand. And that's how you can attract the people to come to. If you are giving a good service, they have a good coffee, good milkshakes and smoothies and all. So people will come here and have a good coffee. What we need to maintain is that we give a good taste. We keep our maintaining our taste. The taste should not go down. For the business to sustain its momentum, the shop needs to rely on young professionals like Tochi Ibe. Their penchant for coffee is what coffee vendors need to turn their dreams around. Most have traveled abroad and have exotic tastes and could influence more peers to switch to coffee. Not just that, sustaining concentration levels for extended work routines. I like to walk even, even when it's past midnight. I want to work and then ensure that you know, the, the tax for the day or the tax for the week is achieved within the time that I have. And so because of that, I, I would want to stretch myself and the only thing that can keep me up, personally for me, is coffee. Tochi Ibe is part of a growing number of Nigerian middle class whose preferences are changing. Like her, Biola Ademuaga is hooked already, and she has everything nice to say about her newly acquired habit. I like tasting. I'm a very adventurous person with my taste buds, and I realize that coffee gets me going. It has a jolt that I enjoy, so yes. I, there's no reason to stop now. Besides the indigenous middle class, Classic Rock Coffee is looking to tap into the expert community here. Coffee culture may be a new phenomenon in Nigeria's capital city, but it's likely to boom in the coming years. Coffee consumption here grew by 5% in 2010. It's a huge leap for the beverage in the country of 170 million people. A huge opportunity to ignore. Sub-Saharan Africa produces the finest coffee in the world, yet it retains the small fraction of the coffee revenue. Observers of the coffee trade say major producers can significantly boost earnings if the bulk of the coffee is produced and consumed locally. Kilechi Amekalam, CCTV Abuja, Nigeria.